Hello guys, this is Amos Doll Music, and in today's lesson, I'm going to teach you how to play Die Very Rough by Mario Judah. So here we go, give you a preview of the section you're going to learn. This is the main catchy section you're going to learn in today's lesson. Check it out. Make a repeat with improvisations. Let's get right into it. So let's break it up to parts is easier to learn. Here we go. Break up to four parts, all right? So the first part starts on the D here, middle C, go up an octave C, D here. It goes D, E, F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, and then three E's, one, two, three, and then two D's. That's it for the first part. Let's do it again. So it goes D, E, F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, E, 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 D, D. That's it for the right hand. Left hand, two chords here. Remember these two chords because every single part are these two particular chords, okay? The two chords are B minor, B, D, F sharp, and second inversion of E minor, which is B, E, G. So remember these two chords, because every single part are these two chords in this order, all right? Two hands together, for this first part goes like this, right hand starts, F sharp and B minor together, E and the next chord together. That's it for the first part, let's do it again. So it goes, together, together. That's it for the first part. Moving on to the second part, right hand continues. Right hand goes F sharp, F sharp, G, F sharp, E, E, D, E, E, D, D. That's it for the second part for the right hand. Let's do it again. So it goes F sharp, F sharp, G, F sharp, E, E, D, E, E, D, D. That's it for the right hand. Left hand, same two chords again. That's why I said it was so important to learn the two chords in the first part. Anyway, the two chords, once again, is B minor and second inversion of E minor. All right, so with those two chords in mind, two ends together goes like this. So F sharp and B minor together. E and chord together. There you go. One more time, it goes together, together. All right, so yeah. Back to back, the two parts of blunt so far will be played like this. Yeah, moving on to the third part, Ryan continues, it goes E, D, E, F sharp, E, F sharp, G, 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 F sharp. That's it for the right hand. Let's do it again. It goes E, D, E, F sharp, E, F sharp, G, 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 F sharp. That's it for the right hand. Left hand, same two chords again that you know. B minor and the second version, E minor. Okay, two hands together goes like this. The so right hand starts on the E, D and the B minor together. G and chords together. There you go. One more time, it goes together, together. All right, moving up. Uh, actually, back to back, the three parts we've played so far, we play like this, check it out. Okay, moving on to the fourth and last part of this section, right hand goes F sharp, E, D, D, C sharp, C sharp, C sharp, C sharp, B. That's it for the right hand. Let's do it again. So it goes F sharp, E, D, D, C sharp, C sharp, C sharp, C sharp, B. That's it for the right hand. Left hand, same two chords again. So B minor and the second version, E minor. With that in mind, two hands together goes like this. So F sharp and B minor together. C sharp and chord together. There you go. One more time. So it's together. Together. That's it. So back to back, all four parts of this lesson will be played like this. Yeah, that's it. So once you get the melody and chords all good, you can start to add your own improvisations and decoration patterns. Left hand, you can do like octave for the bass note of the chord, and then arpeggio patterns, rhythmic patterns. That kind of thing, because like, it's always the same two chords, so you can really just go ham and make up your own version of it, okay? And same for the right hand, you can harmonize the bass on the chords underneath the melody to make it thicker in texture. So you can do something like this. Yeah. 
yeah, play around with it. Pretty awesome tune. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed this lesson. If you did, make sure to smash like. And as for now, check out all my other tutorials on this channel and see you next time. If you enjoyed this lesson, make sure to check out the rest of my channel because literally there are multiple thousands and thousands of these videos ranging from pop songs of all languages, meme songs, video game music, movie, anime and cartoon theme songs and many more songs of all sorts that I teach. So most likely you can find your favorite song to learn on my channel. Also check out my website, bestpianomethod.com, linked in the description below if you want to learn more piano from me. Learn from my piano courses on how to play by ER, improvise, read sheet music, how to play and sing, and many more courses at all types of levels, even for those who have never touched a piano before. As for now, enjoy your time around my channel and see you next time.